Hello everyone, in this quick video, uh, I'm going to show you how the students submit the assignment through Google Classroom, just in case you're wondering how does it look like in the student interface. So when they click to an assignment task like this, once they click on it, they will be able to see the task and also the instruction that you have given them. Like in this case, please write your essay in Google Docs based on this topic. So you have given them an instruction to do it in Google Docs, so all they have to do is add. Uh, normally they can just upload their file or link it or from the Google Drive if they want to but since you ask them to do it in Google Docs so they just create a new Google Docs so a new Google Docs will, will be created once it's created this will pop up then they can type the essay here if they do it if they've done it online all right if they've done it online they can just copy paste it here if not they can type it here all right so the best time of my life blah 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 okay once done they just click turn in up here you will be redirected to the uh, task page just now assignment details part um, they can immediately click hand in if they want to if not they can cancel first and then you know do the necessary checking and whatever comment they want then they click click hand in okay once it's hand you know handed in uh, this will appear handed in and then the button unsubmit is uh, given so unsubmit can be done they can unsubmit if they would like to do changes before you did of course or before you have graded them so uh, just click unsubmit if they want to so they can either delete this one upload a new one or they just amend the existing one and click hand in again okay so that's how the students submit the assignment, just in case you're wondering what happens from their view. So if they need to chat with you, they can actually use the private command to chat. I don't quite get this task, for example. All right. Okay, so you can reply to that later. Um, that's all for this quick video, just to show you how it looks like from the student point of view.